a new day, a new project, and uh, here I am again testing a microscope. Now I told you uh, a while ago that I'm gonna command and have some new ones. This one was commanded in uh, 21st of uh, October and it's 26th uh, today. It's amazing, five days, a little bit of care. So it took five days to deliver this. That's amazing fast. So if you remember, I had one before that kind of uh, 1,600 times magnification. I was not happy about the way it was working. Uh, I mean, uh, too much magnification, not enough space to work under the microscope. This time I bought me one with 50 to 500 times magnification. It's very similar like the old one, like the other one. Same story, same uh, really bad support. To use this one, first of all, you need a uh, better have it on the bench, okay. So far, it's something called Danu, and we have 50 to 500 magnification. I think the support should be oh, up here, sorry, up. Have this special channel somehow. And like I said, it's a very, very simple and rudimentary support. So I'm afraid we can't work like that. It's absolutely impossible. Okay, USB. I think this is an USB 2 and they advertise a 500 times magnification, of course, resolution 640 on 480 to 1600 to 1200. Huh, I don't believe that low resolution, but uh, for this purpose, I think it's okay. Let's see what we got here. We already have picture on the screen so far the same here we have the led power light let's install the software oh yes of course it needs access to the drive okay and there we have picture nice okay let me try to record this i'm using vlc to record the desktop 25 frames should be enough there we are well, it's not looking bad. Okay, let me see what I can do. We are right here. You see, this is a transistor. Maybe I will just... There we go. There we go. Ready to have a test. You see, I had uh, this improvised stand here. I'm uh, capturing the screen with... Uh, VLC and I'll try to do some work. Maybe I should go a little bit farther, higher. And let's see. Well, what do you think? I think it's pretty reasonable, isn't that? You see that uh, 390 Resistor there. Let me see if I can make this clear. No, this is maximum. Okay, this is maximum. Anyway, I'll I'll try to take this one out of here. Okay, this one better. Where are you? Where are you? Where are you? This one, three hundred and ninety. Of course, tweezers. You need really good tweezers and I recommend this set of tweezers are very cheap easy to use my hot air station here 400 degrees shall I use a little bit of flux yes my homemade flux 400 degrees and the air it's at five and a half which one? This one. Up it goes. Let's see. We can even see very nice when 
There you go. Come, on, it's usable. Let me have. Let me have a transistor. Okay. One of these guys. Okay, it's just this one. Okay, I'm trying to work only on the screen. Let's see if we can feel when it's melting. And there it goes. Let's see if we can see when it's ready to have the transistor back. There we go. Nice. Beautiful. It's done. Well, I want to have this big guy out of here. It's kind of too big for for this uh, microscope. But let's see if we can take it out. I don't like the angle. The angle is very bad. Let's try here. I can't use my hot air station. Where are you? There it goes. A little bit higher. No. Down. <laughs> and it's gone. Now let's see. Let's see if we can put it back. First, let me. Okay, I think I have to prepare the board first. Okay, nice. Let me see. I'm only trying to watch the screen. We are good there. Pretty good. Yeah. I'll do a different approach this time. Let me have some... Oh, that's just moving a little bit. Okay, I got that in place. Yeah. And I need another one here. What do you think? That's okay. I'll fix that later. What about here? Good. Uh, not so good down here, but anyway. Of course it can be better. But it's just the idea of the things, you know. Can we use this little microscope or not? Well, I think. All I can feel is a little delay. But it's not so tragic. Okay. Okay, let me see if I can take this one out with the hug on. Of course, I did it. Now turn around. There she is. And it's done. Can we put it back? With the soldering gun. Kind of mess, but these are so tiny. There's a point. Okay. 
Yep. We are good here. Where are you, my dear? Oh, right there. And success. You can't believe it how tiny are these little parts. Okay, let me show you. So we have a ruler here. So that should be one one millimeter, one point one or something anyway. From there to there, one one millimeter and a half. These are really tiny. These are millimeters, guys. So look at that uh, capacitor here. It's one point one something millimeters. Can we take it out? Get the hot gun? Why not? Yeah, and out it goes. Shall we put it back? Oh no. Oh no no. No no no. When you have a really tiny, a really, really tiny, you know something, uh, flux, it's always helping. So a little flux in place will keep the parts in the right position. Oh. Finally, not so elegant, but I'm pretty sure it's working. There we go. So, what do you think, guys? Can you use this? I think we can. With a proper stand and uh, with a proper stability, it can be used very, very nice. And now let's have some tests about maximum magnification. And uh, you see now we are on 50. Let's put it on 500. Can we see anything over there? Oh yes, but we have to go really, really, really down. Yeah. Oh, there we go. <laughs> Here we have one of those 390 resistor. Look there. Man, this is incredible. It's way too much. But we can try to do something else. You see, adjust the magnification a little bit right to the board. And we can check the board for. Uh, Problems, you know, like uh, look there. What's that on the board? Stars, and that's amazing. I think it's kind of paint. Yeah, kind of paint or flux. Anyway, let's see. One of those little guys here. Nine one three. Look what I'm talking about. It's one of these. So you see here one zero three. Let's try to go. No, it's too much. You see, we are on the bottom of the board. Look, 
down to the board. You can have a kind of very close inspection with this kind of microscope. Okay. Is it, uh, is it okay? Is it workable? Oh yeah, I think so. We have a proper stand. Steady. And uh, on 50 times magnification, like up here around 10 centimeters, it's absolutely workable. Look, that should be nice. That should be okay. But like I said before, you see the problem here is with the stand. You need a really good stand. No vibration, anything. So yes, it's usable. For this money, it's absolutely fabulous. Thank you for now, guys. Please like, subscribe, comment, and don't forget to have fun. See you soon in some other projects. Bye-bye.